Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Kim, a fairly average mum, and today I'm going to be unboxing my birch box for August and July because I forgot. So let's get cracking. Ah, yeah, so I genuinely forgot about my birch box for July. It's just been sitting in a pile with other things that I need to get round to, and I just totally forgot it were here. So this is the birch box for July. It came in this bag. All right, and this is the birch box that's just arrived for August. Right, so birch box, it, for those of you that don't know, birch box is a subscription box that you get once a month. It costs £13.95 a month. Now you can get it on like, like I do, which is month by month subscription, and that's what you'll pay. Or you can buy it in chunks of like three months, six months, 12 months. Um, and that makes it fractionally cheaper. I just like the flexibility of being able to cancel these things if I don't want to continue with them. But I have decided to keep up with my birch box. Um, I, I still get my glossy box, my birch box, uh, my rocker box and look incredible I think I think those are the ones that I'm currently subscribed to but anyway my one came for last month it were a bit delayed sorry I'm just throwing my phone on there it was slightly delayed when my birch box for last month so that's why I didn't end up unboxing it right when I got you know right at the beginning of the month but this one came almost straight away so now I've got them both I thought I'd do them both together okay so let's have a look see what's inside them Put my gigs on right okay so we'll start with the july one since it's been here the longest just in case there's an expiration date on these things so anyway it's coming this like makeup -y bag it's a good size makeup bag and it says birch box on there i'd actually use that you know it's not one of those teeny weeny little ones that you can't put out in so very happy with that so let's pull out what's inside it and see whether it tells me price i suspect not but anyway let's have a look so you get this little leaflet with it and it says countryside charm on it nice um july birch box has it got the prices on or if i remember rightly right they sometimes put the prices on and they sometimes put the prices on of the full size product so i'll probably have to work them out for you and put on the sort of recommended retail price for the sort of gram for gram or you know, whatever the product that size it actually is. So anyway, I've got this green thing in my hand, so I might as well go with this first. So it says refill on it, does it? Refill what? Refill, beauty balm, balsam, balsamo. It's just a beauty balm, Kim. <laughs> Don't try and read another blooming language. You're no good at this language, let alone anything else, right? So what is it? What's it say? Not just a lip balm. This is your ultimate all-over salve. Endlessly refillable. Made with a blend of natural oils, hyaluronic acid, ceramides, and squalene. Squalene? What's that? It hydrates and conditions dry skin. Okay, let's give it a go. Put it on here. Nope, smells now. Don't smell of anything. It is just a lip balm, but very nice. It's in a nice sort of matte green package. Now, I take it you can just pull this thing out and put a new one in, so you're not having to reuse... You know, you can reuse this out of packaging. Yeah, it's a lip balm. Nice. I quite like it. I do sometimes use a lip balm, occasionally, very occasionally, but I will use that one anyway, so that's my first thing. And then next up, what's this? This baggy thing here, what is it? This looks interesting. What is this? Oh my days, it's one of these things that you put on your Swede, isn't it? I can't work out how to use these. I've tried. I don't know what you do with them. I just put my hair up in a towel when I get out of the shower. But I think this is, you put, you're put. you supposed to be able to like twist it round or something like that. You pull it on your hair like so, right? And then you twist this bit round here, right? God, what a body <laughs> And then you pull it up like so and button it somewhere at top here. Is it a button here? 
there's a button somewhere. You pull it up like that anyway, I think, and that that's it. That's what you're supposed to look like. No. I, well, I can't work it for a start. I don't know what I'm doing with it. So I will pass that on to somebody else who might be able to work it and use it. One of my daughters, I'm sure they're more sensible than me. I've got no clue with that one. I just use a towel. I get out of the shower, I put a towel around my head, twist it round and pull it up and that does it. You know what I mean? So anyway, I'll just stick with my towel and I'll pass that on to somebody else. But nice, you know. Hey, tell me price here. Uh, microfiber hair towel, full size, supposed to be £15. Okay. That other thing uh, were a full size product and that had a recommended retail price to be £11 for that lip balm. So nice. So let's have a look at these other things. Okay, so next up is this. Collagen infused booty. Sweet almond, peppermint, foot therapy, collagen infused beauty. Let's have a look by Beauty Pro. I quite like Beauty Pro things. They smell gorgeous, a lot of them. All right, so it's like a little pair of socky things that you just slice across there and then you put them on. Oh, it smells really nice. I like that. That smells really fresh and lovely. I'm going to put those on tonight. Really happy with those ones. How much are they? Oh, I'm really happy. They smell absolutely gorgeous. You leave them on for 20 minutes and they're supposed to make your feet nice and soft. So super happy with them. Really love those. So really happy. And it says they have got a recommended retail price of 4 95 So great. Next up is this. Is this for your hair? Philip Kingsley Elasticizer Therapies Deep Conditioning Treatment. Is it for hair? Please let it be for hair. I love anything that you whack on your eggs. My hair's as dry as out at the moment. Yeah, pre-shampoo treatment. Let's have a little sniff of this. Now it says recommended retail price £37, but that'll be for a full size one, not this. Ooh, that's got an unusual fragrance. Ooh, yeah. I've not smelled anything like that. It says Egyptian jasmine and mandarin. It smells gorgeous, but it's very unlike hair products that I've tried up to this point. But I do like it. It feels very creamy on my hand. Next time I wash my hair, right, maybe tomorrow, I'll whack that on before I actually uh, shampoo. So really happy with that one. I love all that they get to give you for your hair, honestly. And I'm running low on my shampoo as well, so I could do with some more shampoo. Just putting out there for any birch box or glossy box or anybody else. I, I could do with some more shampoo, thanks. And then last up is this one. Arrow Radiant Skin Moisturiser. Okay, Let's see if it says out in here. Now it says, recommended retail, it says £18, but I imagine that's for a full size as well. So I'll try and work it out and put it on screen for you. Arrow is a, a, our in-house clean and vegan beauty line that we developed to simplify your routine. <laughs> yeah, anyway, they've developed their own. They've realised there's a market for it. So here we go. Oh, it's got a pinkish tone. Look at that. Wow. What does this one smell like? It smells a bit like oil of you. Lay that. I think. Yeah, it's got a bit of a fragrance of oil of you. Lay or oil of ole, as they call it now. Whatever they're calling it. Or just ole. What used to be oil of you, lay. It just reminds me of that. But nice. It's only a wee little bottle. It's not going to last you forever. But, you know, nice to have a try. So that's all my things anyway, my July um, birch box that I totally forgot about. I think my favourite things for me are probably um, the foot things, because I like those. The hair um, pack thing that will be able to moisturise my hair because it's all getting a bit dry with after all the sun. Um, I love the makeup bag as well. 
Um, yeah, so they're my favourite things. The only thing that I probably won't use will be that hair wrap thing because I have no clue. As you can see, anything that is not very simple to use, I haven't got a clue about. But anyway, I'll pass that on to one of my daughters. I'm sure one of them will want it. So anyway, the next, um, this birch box, and I will say this, right? At one point, birch box were sending us out really boring packaging. But they feel, feel like this past two months, they've really upped the game. So that one last month came in the makeup bag. And this looks really pretty. Look at that. It's got like a little draw effect. Oh, it says Cosmic Beauty. There we are. I'm liking that they've upped the game a bit with these. Feels a bit more like you've bought a high-end product. You know, I know it's only $13.95 like, but you do want to feel like it's a bit of luxury. You know, $13.95 is still a chunk of money to be spending every month. You want it to come and feel like you really want to open it, you know, and it feels like the gift box this, so I'm really happy with it. Looks like we've got a few products in it as well. So let's have a little look, see, see what Cosmic Beauty is about. All right, so we'll try this one first. Is it a lippy? Please let it be a lippy. Ola Neon Wine Me. Let's open it. See what it is. Please let it be something nice. Oh, it's looking like it might be a lippy. Oh my goodness, look at that colour. I like that an awful lot. Let's put swatch that here. Oh, that is a bit of me, that colour. I love it. That is so pretty. I like that a lot. And especially because we're getting, I mean, I know it's August now, but it won't be long before we're getting onto the autumn, will it? You know, and um, and that colour will come in really handy because I love all this sort of burgundies and sort of cherries and things like that when it gets to the autumn. So very happy with that one. And what's the recommended retail price on that? £12. So that's not a bad price either. All that neon. Uh, wine me lipstick balm this lipstick li and lip balm hybrid is buildable mulberry shade shiny like gloss i like it i like it a lot so what else have i got in here what's this one so this is tan milk tan extender milk tan extender milk see i don't do self tan so i don't know what it is by Mind Tan. It says it's got a recommended retail. Well, it says eleven ninety nine, but that might be for the full size. Mind Tan is Australia's number one salon professional tanning brand. And Aussies know a thing or two about perfectly bronzed skin, do they? Okay. So that's that one. Um, gradual tanning lotion. I am not going to use that. I'm going to pass that on to somebody else because I'm not very good at them. I to be honest, I can't get them to sort of blend, so I end up with bits that are really dark, bits that are really light, you know. So I won't use that one, but I will pass it on to somebody else. My daughter will really like it. I gave her a load that I've got in other boxes of tan, a sort of self-tan and things. She's been using them up for me. So, yeah, I'll pass that on to her. I'm sure she'll like it. And then next, what's this one? Lord and Berry. Line shade glam eye pencil. Okay, is it an eyeliner? Antique bronze. Get in. Is this a different colour to black? No way. We get loads of black. Loads and loads of black. It is a different colour as well. Look. Oh, pretty. Oh, I like that one. Yeah, it's got a metallic. I was going to say I'd better use it on my brows as well, but actually it has got a metallic sheen to it, so it's definitely an eyeliner. Now, that is a more usable colour for me because the black is just too dark for me because it, it shows up the fact that I'm absolutely pantsy. Do you know what I mean? Whereas this one will be a lot more helpful to me because I'll be able to blend it out a bit. But I like that one a lot. I like, I don't mind Lord and Berry. We do get quite a few of Lord and Berry products, but um, but they are all right, you know. And especially when it's a nice colour like that, that I feel like I can use. So that's actually two makeup items in this box. Very happy with that. Um, and it says it's got a recommended retail price of £10. £10. 
That's it. Okay. It says, Lord and Berry believe that a swipe of your favourite lipstick or a flick of eyeliner is the same as a fashion accessory. Do they? I don't. But anyway, <laughs> we'll agree to differ on that one, right? Okay. So next up is this. Please let it be a shampoo. Please let it be a shampoo. What is it? No, it's a... Oh, God, it's in French. It says high performance hair care. Jouer d'or... Tom Smoothing Balm. I'm sure that's not how you pronounce it. Number by number four, and it's number four's formulas are entirely gluten, sulfate, sodium, chloride, and paraben free. Um, multitasking balm is perfect for you, whether your hair is dry, frizz prone, or coarse. All right, so it is for your hair. So let's have a little go at this. Put a bit on my palm and then I'll smooth it on. Ooh, look at that. It's very creamy. Let's have a little sniff. Oh, it smells like nice hair dresses. It's got a vaguely masculine, masculine fragrance as well. So it's not really sweet and florally. It has got, you know, men could use that as well, I think. Yeah, it has vaguely masculine fragrance to it, which I'm happy about. I don't mind wearing that, you know. Make me feel like I've been in contact with nice men. Is that an oxymoron? <laughs> I'm not sure. Am I just jaded? <laughs> anyway, so that's that one. Very nice. Oh, it makes my hair smell lovely. Really, really lovely. And last up is this one. What's this? Now be detox unpolluted. What is it? I'll have to read it off here. Now bear products, uh, yada, yada, yada. Feeling extra tired lately? Yes, yes I am. Refresh your face with this skin quencher any time of day. Spray when you wake up, after you put on your makeup or before bed. Made with a mixture of fruit, hyaluronic acid and aloe vera. Facial cocktail is sure to feel, leave your skin feeling hydrated and energized. Okay, big claims. Let's see if it works. Take my specs off. Wow, it's quite a powerful jet. <laughs> I'm glad I took my glasses off, otherwise it might have taken them off for me. Blummy neck. Hey, dear. Flippy flops. It smells really nice, so really, really nice. So I'm not sure that it's done a great deal for my face. It might be melting my, eye, my mascara, but, um, but it smells super nice. Really, really nice. Makes me feel like my nose is running now as well. Oh, wow. It did come out it, with a force, that one. So maybe you have to stand well back when you're doing that one. But anyway, really nice. So did it tell me the price? It says £16, but I suspect not for that size. So what I'll do is I'll try and work out the price. I'll have been putting them on the screen as we've been going. Um, and I'll try and put on the overall price for August's uh, Birch Box here so that you'll get an idea of what you're getting for your money. But I honestly feel really happy with them. I feel like they've upped the game tremendously this past couple of months. At one point, we were getting like these brown boxes that weren't very pretty. Is my glasses steaming up with that spray? Anyway, um, we were getting these brown boxes that weren't very pretty. Um, you know, it didn't look like they were, the collections were put together with any real thought recently and certainly this past two months it feels like they have massively upped the game also it doesn't feel like we're getting loads and loads of sample sizes anymore it feels like we're getting a, some really good products in there so i'm really happy that i continued with my birch box because it were hit and miss whether i, I said goodbye to this one or look fantastic because i liked both but i decided to keep this one on and i'm glad i did now because i feel like i'm really getting my money's worth in these but anyway, that's everything for today. If you've liked this video, please give us a like. It really helps us out. And if you like this kind of content, you might want to consider subscribing. I've left all my contact details in the description box in case you want to contact me for any reason. And I'll also link Birchbox in case you want to go ahead and get yourself a box. You know, I certainly like this month's. I think this month's is my favourite I've had in a long time. Um, but thank you very much for taking a few moments out of your day to spend with me. Bye!